Hi, my name is Mark uh, Stallard, and welcome to I'm Alive, I'm Alive Animation. And I'm going to show you very quickly, in just a minute or two, uh, just how to animate, uh, some tips on how to animate eyes and make those eye movements. Just to look a little bit more realistic, a little bit more fluid. And I'm going to be using the rig that I just created uh, with the Easy Eyes uh, tutorial. So go check that out um, if you haven't already. Uh, but you can, this the principle of, the principle of, um, what I'm doing can be used with any rig that you have created. And the idea is, quite simply, just to get the eyes to close, to blink as the eyes move. And I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So here we go. Okay, so here's the rig I just created in the Easy Eyes tutorial. Um, the, the key to uh, making the eyes just a little bit more believable, a little bit more uh, fluid, a little bit more natural, is to actually get them to blink um, as the eyes move. So I'm just going to uh, get start here at about uh, 12 frames, about half a second. I'm now going to create a keyframe for each of those three bones. Um, and I'm using the manipulate tool, tool bones. Just click on each one once, create those, um, that keyframe. And then I'm going to move to um, frame 18. So that's about, about a quarter of a second. And then I'm going to make the eye blink. So close the eye, make sure we go the right way. And then a quarter of a second later on the 24th frame, I'm going to make them open up again. Now what we're going to do here is I'm going to get this guy now to move from one side to the other so he's now looking at the front i'm now going to click on the frame 24 make him look to the side and we'll see how that looks you see how natural that looks um, and then we're going to hold off there and i'm going to create another set of keyframes and all i'm doing is i'm just using the bone and manipulation tool then we're going to go back here again to about another quarter of a second to frame 42. I'm going to make him blink again. And then I'm going to go another quarter of a second, frame 48. Open it up to where it's natural. Oop, click on the wrong tab there. And you can, so you can see. All right. And now I'm going to click here, eyes side, just to create that keyframe. And then I'm going to click on frame 48, move it all the way to the other side. And then we're just going to keep doing this. Um, okay, maybe I'll start on frame 27, create the keyframes. And we'll get the blink. Another quarter of a second. Go, undo the blink. I'm going to click on the eye side again, create that keyframe. Click on 84. I'm going to make him look straight ahead. So we'll see again. See how that works. Now you will see some little overlaps here. You can fix that if you like. You can move the eyes up and down if you want to. Uh, just for the sake of this tutorial, I'm not going to do that. Then I'm going to go back to um, 96. And again, create the keyframes on 96. I'm going to go to uh, 102. I'm going to make him blink again. 108, another quarter of a second. Make him look up. Sorry, um, that was the blink open. Now I'm going to create the eyes up and down now. Oop, move that back where it needs to be. Create the keyframe on that one. And now I'm going to make him look down. And then we'll see how that works, right? <laughs> and I think in this particular case, I probably will. I probably will move that eyelid, eyelid the, uh, iris rather. Here we go. And then we're going to go to frame 120. I'm going to collect all, um, create keyframes for all of those. Another quarter of a second or so. And uh, sorry, uh, yep. Then I'm going to get him to blink again. I'm going to move that eye up just so that it's not in the way. And then I'm going to do something big. I'm going to make him look really up now. And then I'm just going to. Just get him back to normal. Okay, I'm going to get him. Oh, yep, something like that. Good, and then we'll put him back there. Oh, eyes up and down. Where am I? If I do that, then I will stop it from coming out the bottom there. Okay, so we'll go back to the beginning and we'll watch that play.
And you can see how natural that looks. It's fluid and it's easy to do, particularly as we've got the, um, the bones there, the smart bones helping us do it. So there you go. Okay, so there you have it. That's a quick and easy way to, um, to animate your eyes. Um, if you do the blink, it just helps for that bit more fluid movement. So when you're looking from one side to the other, it just looks a little bit more natural. Um, and so it makes it a little bit more effective. So I hope you've enjoyed that. If you have, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much.